वेलकम फ्रेंड्स कंप्यूटर फंडामेंटल्स के विंडोज ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम में आपका सभी का स्वागत है दिस इज द विंडो स्क्रीन ऑन विच वी कैन सी द स्मॉल आइकन पिक्चर दैट आर नोन एज आइकन्स इन द आइकन्स आर नथिंग बट द इंडिविजुअल प्रोग्राम्स दैट आर इंस्टॉल्ड ऑन टू योर सिस्टम दिस इज योर माय कंप्यूटर आइकन बाय डबल क्लिकिंग इट यू कैन एक्टिवेट योर फोल्डर स्क्रीन सो इन फोल्डर्स को क्लिक करके हम लोग हमारे हम वी कैन क्रिएट फोल्डर्स दीज आर द ड्राइव सी सी ड्राइव डी ड्राइव एंड ई ड्राइव डिपेंड्स अपॉन योर सिस्टम हाउ मच ड्राइव आर देयर रिगार्डिंग हाउ मेनी स्पेस इज अवेलेबल ऑन योर हार्ड ड्राइव यू हैव द पार्टीशन दीज आर नोन एज द पार्टीशन एंड दीज आर द डेस्कटॉप डाउनलोड्स एंड दीज आर द फोल्डर्स ऑन विच यू कैन वर्क सपोज आई वॉन्ट टू एक्टिवेट माई कंप्यूटर फोल्डर माई कंप्यूटर फोल्डर को ऑन करने के साथ में उसमें जो जो फोल्डर से वी कैन सी दैट रिलेटेड फोल्डर्स ऑटोमेटिकली गेट ओपन हो गए वी कैन क्रिएट न्यू फोल्डर होगा हेयर से राइट क्लिक से न्यू एंड से फोल्डर Now your folder is created. You can give the name. Give any name. And press enter. That folder is created over here. You can change appearance of your desktop by right clicking, say personalize, and these are the themes that is given to your system. Suppose I this is your current scheme, and अभी मुझे दूसरा scheme change करना है, so I will select the second theme. I'll just close it. Now your appearance of system is change, theme is change. Again, you want the previous theme only. So right click and say personalize, and you are giving another theme that is Windows default theme, and say close. So again, your Windows is restored. The bar that is recited at the bottom of the desktop is known as the task bar. The current open task is attached to this task bar, and this is your command button. Windows command. This quickly you can activate it by just clicking it. In Windows 8, these are the options and these are the system-oriented commands. You have to click on this command arrow and just scroll down. These are the programs that are installed on the system. Suppose I want to open any program from here. I'm opening Paint. So this is your Paint screen, and this is the tools of your Paint window. You can arrange these icons by right-clicking. Say sort by. You can arrange by name. By default, this arrange by name. Say size. Now the arrange as size. So right click, say sort by, say name. So right click, say sort by, say item type. So right click, say sort by, say date modified. So it, it's a, uh, it's arranged or sorted as per your requirement. You can view. The icon type as large icon, so icon will be changed to large large icon. Go to say view, say medium icon. Icon is changed to medium icon, and say view, say small icon. So icons is arranged to small icons. When you are dragging this icons, they automatically reset it to bot.
because the feature auto arrange is on so right click and say view and make it off say auto arrange off now you can drag it anywhere you can place it anywhere because your feature auto arrange is off again you make it on say view say auto arrange on so icons are automatically arranged to the system the refresh command is just used to refresh say refresh You can create any file from here, so right click, say new. You can create folder on the desktop, say new folder. Now, new folder is created over here. You can give any name over here and say OK. So, your folder is created. This is a folder. You can create any file also, say new and say. any problem so I am creating text document click so your text doc document is created over here it's okay so your text document is created over here In Windows operating system, one utility is there that is known as the Recycle Bin. This is your recycle bin. Suppose any file I don't want, I don't want to keep it. I select it and I'm pressing delete. Right click, say delete. So that file is deleted from your desktop, but it is not directly deleted from the system. It is restored or it is placed into your recycle bin so you have to go to recycle bin by double clicking it see this file is stored here suppose you want to delete it just right click your options are there restore or delete or cut suppose I say restore now it is restored from your system and it comes again here And suppose you delete it say yes and you don't want to keep it anymore go to say right click and say delete it will ask you whether you want to delete it permanently so you want if you want to delete it permanently say yes so this is just how simply we operate windows operating system and you can shut your system by pressing on windows button right clicking windows button say shut down and say shut down thank you friends this is just the introduction to windows operating system thank you welcome again